There was no way of getting out of this, no. I must have been crazy when we did it. <laughs> Once I'm in the car and the door's closed, they bring the bubble over the top and uh, it's then located and fixed from outside to secure it. Uh, things you look at it and you think, should I do it or shouldn't I? Mm -hmm. And always, I was always one for trying things out experimentally. I thought, well, with it, 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 it could work. Let's try it, and that, that's a, that's all you can do. Accelerate through the gears. I got in top. I'm now pulling about five, five eight, and way way ahead, I can see the checkered board where the measured mile is. I'm now pulling what, what Jack Emerson said, don't go above 5.8 revs. Because what, the was that, what was 5.8 five, eight five, eight RPMs. Speed. Uh, yeah. That was doing around about the 150 or 60-ish. Yeah. And then by the time I reached the... I was going to back off and I thought, uh, no, I'll leave it. So I left it, it went up to uh, six, 60 when I hit the checkered board. And uh, it, it was running beautiful. So I went through the measured mile and it pulled 60 all the way through. I knew that was pretty quick, but I didn't know really how quick it was at the time. There was a little bit of side movement and, and the steering occasionally went a bit light. So I, I realized there was probably a, a little bit of lift going, but, uh, but it wasn't too bad. Turned around and come down the other side, and there was the uh, uh, all the press people and the, and the timekeepers and everybody. They're all crowded round. So he slowly walked from there round here, the green, and I was sitting there. And he put his arms around me, give me a big hug, and he said, "You buggy, you know what you've done?" I said, "No." He said, "172.4." He said, "You've shattered it." And that then all the crowd cheered. Yeah. So in all, it's. It still holds the record now, you yes. see. So he lofty gave me the phone and um, I said hello, good morning, sir. And he said, well done, Dewey. He said, uh, I told you, I told you you could do it, you know, and all this. I said, yeah, I said, I had a good run, thank you. He said, I've told uh, Lofty you can go into Brussels tonight um, and have a little bit of a party. He said, but don't forget, Dewey, champagne's very expensive. <laughs>